Okay, in this problem, what we're going to be asked to do here is graph a circle, and we're given the equation. So we're going to need basically two things in order to graph the circle. The first thing we're going to need is the center. And then the next thing we're going to need is the radius. If we can find the center and the radius, then we just draw our dot for our center and then compute the radius and then just draw our circle. So to find the center, we need to find the h and the k out of the formula. So notice we were given the standard form of a circle here. We have to, first of all, look at this and say, okay, in the, in the standard formula, it looks like x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. So here we have minus h, here we don't have a minus, but we could rewrite that as being x minus negative two squared. So therefore, negative two is the h. So our center so far has the x coordinate or the h here is negative two. And then here for the y coordinate or the k, all we do is we, we notice that in the formula there's a minus here, minus here, so k is just five. So that's our center. Now an easier way to do that is just to look at each of the numbers and, and just take their opposite. So here you have plus two, you put minus two. Here you have negative five, you just put positive five. Now to get our radius, we want to remember that in our formula, the number at the end here is our radius squared. So we know that our radius squared is equal to 16, and we can take the square root of both sides. So r equals square root of 16. Now normally we would do plus or minus here, but because the radius of the circle is always positive, we're just going to look at the positive answer, and that's just 4. So now our goal is to graph this. And let's just remember this is our center, and that's our radius. So I'll just draw our graph real quick over here. Okay, I'm going to go out negative 2. I'm going to say negative 2, up 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I'm going to draw a dot. That's the center of our circle. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go 4 units for our radius. So I'm going to go, let's say, 4 units down from the center. 1, 2, 3, 4, that's here. And I could just go and draw it. One, two, three, four units up. So up and up and below the center. And then we could go to the left. Let's say one, two, three, four. And then here we go one, two, three, four. And we just kind of eyeball it and draw our circle the best we can. So that's the graph of the circle uh, given the equation that we were given in the beginning. And remember the center is at negative two, five, and the radius was four.